New York Times reporter Ested Herndon was on CNN this morning speaking about what happened in the Tennessee State House last night. It's beyond, it's stunning to me. Taking a bullhorn to the well is what you should do yeah, yeah. when people, that is the least of what you should be doing be when people are dying. Because what's the biggest grievance here? Is it that decorum was messed up by these lawmakers? Is it the response or is it the original act that has cost folks lives, right? Like we can move away from the actual tangible issue that was being protested here when we focus on things like decorum. But when you heard, you know, folks, folks like President Obama weighing in, talking about civility, talking about the break of decorum, and rules or polarization and the divisions in society. I think those words paper over some stuff too. This is not a both sides mm, polarization type thing. This is asymmetric polarization. This is one party that has changed in much different ways even than the Democratic Party has changed. Mm. And so when you hear a Republican base, they are much more willing to use their power to, to really see, the, to really cut, cut the other side out of the process. They're really more willing to see the other side as inherently invalid in that Democratic process. And that is unique to the Republican side. That's not one-to-one -one between R and D. A humbling yeah. process. It's the best thing you said. In my estimation, you said a lot of good things, but that was this was no, a no. I think that's load. what this was. Yeah, yeah and we'll see.